Good morning. We are early at the house because we have to do as many loads as we can. And it is freezing cold. Look at this. <laughs> and the garden is still covered in snow. We are having Christmas music and now when we are working, <laughs> we are not freezing anymore and it's all going well. My job is to carry all the light stuff and Sergi, <laughs> he's doing Santa Claus's job, <laughs> carrying huge bags, but yeah, we have like not much left and it looks really really good so yeah santa baby <laughs> oh my god no 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 you don't want to do that no <laughs> oh my god <laughs> We have made it to the recycling station and, and Sergi is already unpacking <laughs> and looting. And the road is not frozen, so that's good. And yeah, Apa has been just amazing. Sergi is having very much fun <laughs> with the bags and I will be carrying the straw. All right. Um, <laughs> we have a little intruder in, in the summer kitchen. Yesterday I noticed that two of the persimmons were eaten. I'll show you right now. Here are the persimmons. And I put them outside because I thought these are the birds who, who are sneaking in and eating the persimmons. Um, but today the rest of the fruits was fine. But today we have an apple. And um, yeah, I do think it's a mouse. <laughs> but I'm not allowed to have the monster bag oh, is leaving the house. <laughs> and we have 30 minutes until the dam closes. I'm so happy when the monster bag goes to the dam. <laughs> Okay, let's go. We have 20 minutes. Oh, I think they're gonna be fine. Bye bye, monster. Oh my god! Don't, don't lose the monster back. No, Sergi has to jump down there. He wanted to escape. Oh my god, it's huge. It was fun. Oh yeah, of course. Of course it was.
recording. It's amazing. You can see the difference. Actually, you can. Oh my God. <laughs> it's getting smaller. <laughs> It, it is not, and it's a lot to do, but, well, we filled this, the monster bag and the baby monsters. <laughs> These are really light and easy to carry. And yeah, it's all happening. Look at this. Oh. Wow. Oh, it feels so good. Oh, maybe before New Year. Maybe I hope so. We can we can get rid of this pile. That would be just amazing. It would be a good start for the new year with a clean garden, without the pile. <laughs> All right, and it is time to start cooking lunch. And I think now it's one of my favorite chores at the house: cooking. The stove is just amazing. So far, this is the best lunch at our terrace. <laughs> <High five. laughs> Let's have a look what we have. We have sandwiches. Mmm, nice and warm. Mm. Okay, dig in. <laughs> This is very impressive. <laughs> Was it one hour, one and a half? We filled those and we had lunch. So yeah, one hour, one and a half. That's good. And the pile is much smaller now. Now we are loading the upper and we will be getting rid of this. Ta -da! And then maybe we will fill a few more bags. Okay, let's go, Kozik. Mm -hmm. Good. And now we have, first we have to load the furniture from Cantina and then the doors that we don't need and then the monster bag. All right. Absolutely exhausted. I'm <laughs> really happy because the garbage is leaving our property. And this is amazing. Oh, ah! oh no. I know they're extremely heavy. They doesn't look, but they are heavy. <laughs> Your babies. <laughs> the root surgery was excavating this summer. I never told you when I was digging them, but can you just consider it's a root for butterfly bush? Yes. It's bush, not a tree, but it's, Look at this. Yeah, it's just a bush, but they're very, very aggressive. I think they were growing here for 200 years. 200? No, I think it's two years. 300 years. No. <laughs> <laughs> We've made just an enormous load. Do you think it's secure, this road? No. <laughs> I don't think so. I think, it, <laughs> I think it will roll out on the first it's bump. Perfect. It is not. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Now it it is secure. Yeah. Are you sure? No. <laughs> <laughs> and the view is just stunning. Oh, and this is my impact. Tiny little bird.
I can't believe it looks so good. It looks amazing. Oh, well, definitely the half of the pile is gone officially. I think we, I think we can say that. And we, we are too late. We, we didn't throw away this one. It will wait until Monday. And I just love how the summer kitchen looks like. It is so beautiful. Oh, and I found this painting today at the temp. I think it's really pretty. I have some golden paint. I will paint the, the broken parts, but the colors are perfect for the summer kitchen. <laughs> and now uh, I have to, to pick up something for our friends. <laughs> I'm working as a delivery <laughs> service. <laughs> To be honest, so far, APA is one of the most amazing things I've ever had in my life. It is extremely useful and I just can't imagine how we could live without her. <laughs> Let's have a look what Sergi is doing. I can spy on him. Let's control if he's doing a good job. <laughs> I think he does. Actually, it doesn't look like we've done much from from above here, but I think we, we did the, the biggest part because here it was, all this part was full of garbage. Now it's just this part left. And to be honest, underneath here, there are bushes. So it's not the whole, not the whole thing is the rubbish underneath there are bushes and like little trees so it will be much easier there but hopefully hopefully we will get rid of this pile before new year or maybe christmas i'm not sure bye kotik bye -bye. good luck have fun <laughs> see you tomorrow i close the front door <laughs> there is no way you can escape <laughs> I left some food <laughs> and the sunset is just stunning. Look at the light here. Oh, it's so idyllic, so beautiful. And this side of the house is even better. Now I think we have to organize at least one balcony to be able to sit down and have our evening tea because it's just so sunny on that part of the building and it will be so warm. Yeah, I think we have to clear one balcony, put two chairs and little table. It will be perfect and the sunset is just beautiful. Okay, I have to get into my upper and, and go to the charity shop. I don't need anything. I have to pick out some things for my friends. But if I find something good, definitely I'll buy it. We always need warm mittens and gloves and walking clothes and scarves and things like that. All right. I am at Oro and the sky is just so beautiful. I miss the sunset. Oh. oh, the sky is just stunning, so, so pretty. I love this time of the day when you see on the silhouettes of the mountains, so pretty. And I have to go down to the house to see what Sergi is doing. And I have some things to leave at the house. Oh my god, I can't believe I can hear him in the garden. Is he still in the garden? Oh my god, I can't believe Kotik, you are still in the garden? No way, it is cold and dark, why? Why? Come home, let's go Kotik. No, he doesn't want to stop now. 
poor little thing. No, we have to go home. I'm coming to rescue you. I can't believe it. It's huge. You've done an amazing job, Kortik. But you shouldn't have to because it's dark and cold. Oh my god. No, oh, it was bright and warm. Uh, yeah, and Couple then hours sudden. <laughs> okay. The hero of the year. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. We are making it. Oh. And me, I've got um, in the charity shop the beads for one year Christmas decorations. So I will put them here around my garland. And I think it will be just, just perfect. It's becoming better and better <laughs> with my every single trip to the flea market. <laughs> Wow, it is so beautiful with the snow and officially half of the pile is gone. Kotik, can you believe it? Yeah, okay. High five. This is my, this is why my body in the... <laughs> wow, it's amazing. So, shall we go tomorrow to Milan and have fun? No. Oh, we come here and we have no, fun with the pie. It's super boring. No, it will be fun. The Christmas market and everything. Ah. No. So you prefer pile? Yep. Okay. Everything you want. <laughs> I've got this beautiful, beautiful pot with the burner today at the charity shop. And this evening, Sergei and me taking turns to clean it, to polish it, and the difference is amazing. Look, this is before and this is after. Just look at that, how shiny it is. I can't believe it. It was five euros. The port, it has a lid and there is a handle here, so you just cleaned it up. So it goes in there and there is uh, the same kind of burner I have with a pan. And it's all in really good condition. And it was five euros. And of course it was like um, somewhere abandoned in the bottom, at the bottom of the shelf. And it wasn't shiny at all. It is like that. And now when we are polishing it, it's shiny and nice. I love it. The difference is huge. And actually I found a um, copper polisher at the house. So yeah, it's all meant to be. And I can't wait to have a um, mushroom soup in this beautiful pot back at our garden. I can't believe Gordic the difference is amazing. It is so beautiful. <laughs> so so beautiful. And I love the detail here. Because usually when you find um copper pan or or a little pot, the handle is not good. But this handle is just amazing. Look at this. It's in a really good condition. And then the other lovely thing I got today is this, um, it's not a candle. So this is a bird, porcelain bird. With, um, so you put um, an oil and there was a bottle of oil together with it. You put olive oil there and it burns.
months it's a little burner and it was three euros brand new love it also <laughs> i've got this thing which is i'm not sure so it just says that you have to put your oil here and little tea candle down there and this is what it is i'm not sure it was four euros it's a beautiful thing and then there is this little vase which i absolutely adore i think is just so so charming it's made of it's it's a little glass vase but it's made mold so there is seam here and from the other side as well and there is this beautiful decoration and it was two euro fifty cents absolutely stunning good finds i think 